About three years back, Tri-State, a co-op, an electric co-op, a rural, rural electric co-op here across about a five-state region, acquired this facility because they felt they had a need for a combined cycle asset that had the kind of operating characteristics that we had. Uh, but we were at about the 20-year mark in our life cycle. And it just so happens at the 20-year mark, you've really got to roll up your sleeves and take a look around and chase down some obsolescence that you might be wearing. And of course, obsolescence translates into risk. And uh, this particular co-op is mm, a great deal more risk averse than say the independent power plant world. So they tasked me with having a look around, seeing what needed to be done to queue the facility up for the next 20 years. Our legacy control systems were very much a Frankenstein monster. Our desire was to adopt a common platform for every controller in the facility, which comprised five gas turbine governors, two steam turbine governors, um, and an array of uh, balance of plant controls, and tightly integrate them together on a common hardware and software platform. That was very important to us as well as have Ethos Energy deliver a platform that had a broader array of tools than we've been accustomed to having because there's some creative things we wanted to do here in the power plant and the better tools we have, the better we can manage those particular issues. And uh, not only did we see the opportunity to improve the overall efficiency of the power plant, but we can improve on the number of services that we could provide to our customers um, the quality of those services, um, as well as improve our profile for managing uh, air permit compliance, NERC compliance. The better the tools, the more you can, uh, the more creative you can be in trying to resolve operational issues that may uh, present opportunities for non-compliance. So, of course, we were chasing that right out of the gate on day one. We were collecting these tools together, actually working with Ethos Energy to devise better strategies than what we had had prior. Ethos Energy demonstrated to us that they've got a turnkey solution for our gas turbine packages, uh, which was somewhat unique in the marketplace. There were other folks that were trying to trying to sell that notion, but it was clear to us that Ethos had the goods in that regard. Ethos Energy had adopted a fundamental platform that you know had an installed base of tens of thousands of really. It's very much a proven hardware and software platform, um, and it was clear to us that that would be supported for you know years and years and years to come. Ethos gave us the confidence that they were going to be able to deploy their solution in a timely fashion in a risk-averse fashion, because of course we're trying to protect our asset at every turn. And it was clear to us that they had a process that would accomplish that. You know, over the 18-month deployment window, and that's what it was, it was an incremental deployment, you know, we got to build a relationship with those folks, no question about it. Um, it was actually a lot of fun. And it was clear to me that these folks knew what they were doing. Um, and you're, there's always some uncertainty on day one, you know, when you pin the contract as to what exactly it is you're stepping into. But, uh, you know, over the ensuing 18, 20 months of deployment, uh, it was very clear that we were gonna get the job done. And, and, and indeed we have, so I'm, I'm very pleased by that.